Hi folks, Brian Mesco here at Johnson RV. Great day to show you this new arrival to a, on our lot. It is a 2014 Road Trek RS Adventurous. This is built on the Mercedes chassis, the 3500 chassis, 22 feet, nine inches long. Uh, they make a great looking coach. As you look down the outside of this, there's not a lot of big decals, not a lot of big markings, very inconspicuous way to travel around with a home. Um, this is the three liter six cylinder engine. We're looking at 18, 20 miles to the gallon. Very nice. As you look down the side here, you see again, nice lines, very clean. We do have windows that open, they are accordion open, uh, awning open like this so that uh, you can get fresh air in, but keep the rain out. Uh, when you do have, it's a nice big electric awning comes out. Uh, if you want to have a uh, place to plug in your television, uh, radio, whatnot, you can do that there as well. Again, really nice lines. And uh, when you have that awning out, you can put those legs straight down into the ground or you can put them back into the coach. Uh, really secures things up. So you come around to the back, you'll see we've got the backup camera up top there as well as our 5,000 pound towing capacity on that hitch. With these sprinters, you can see we've got uh, not a lot of room inside. So what they do give you is some storage here and seat belts in the back. And then you also have some storage underneath here. And this is actually where the, the customers kept uh, the screen package for the back. Uh, did a very nice job of labeling everything so they knew where it went and what it went to. As you come around this side, you'll see we do have uh, outdoor showers, so hot and cold running water which is nice, you can uh, hose off the kids, the dogs, depending how adventurous you are, take a shower out in the middle of, of the boonies. Uh, we are equipped with aluminum wheels here as well. One nice thing about Road Trek is, uh, again, those nice lines, they don't wanna muck it up with a lot of things on the outside. Uh, so if you see down here, we've got our shore power connection, so that's where we plug in. We also have a spare tire. This is a dually, so you have six tires, but this coach is equipped with seven, so that if you ever get a flat, uh, you have the ability to change that. As we come down here, you see it's also equipped with the mass rating system, a nice hose that you just pull out, a uh, smaller diameter, not the big three and a half inch tube. And what it's got is a garbage disposal, basically for your black tank and gray tank, and it's gonna pull every, grind things up and pull everything out. You've got your handles right here to do that as well, as well as a cable TV connection. And then in our final spot you'll see here is our propane. Uh, this is where we're going to fill uh, propane at and also fresh water hookup. Uh, but again, everything nice and clean, easy, um, really does not look like an RV going down the road. Uh, we do have some solar on top as well as an AC unit. Um, lots of nice things on the outside, but let's go inside and take a look. Hi folks, Brian Meskel here with Johnson RV, now inside the 2014 Road Trek RS Adventurous. As you can see here, we've got the Mercedes cockpit area, very nice, very easy to get to things. You've got a uh, quick reach to the stereo system, which is hooked up with Sirius Satellite. It's got Bluetooth, it's got a, a CD player um, and navigation. So a lot of nice features here very comfortable sitting and driving position you're up a little bit higher you've got a great view around um, when the seat's not turned and uh, a lot a lot of nice things about driving these it's actually a pleasure to drive if you haven't done so already with the rs adventurous we get four captain's chairs up front they all do swivel and move you can see this one is swiveled around we've got the plush seat here swivel swivels that seat actually can be removed and you can put in an extra armoire for more storage if you so choose to but this is a great way to leave the bed in the bed position have a place where four people can comfortably be uh, playing cards having dinner um, telling stories again with uh, these smaller vans uh, storage is at a premium so they give it to you wherever they can you've got I can reach my arm all the way back in there so you've got lots of storage up top here fuse panel here you can see we've got uh, all the brochures and uh, things that came along with the coach as well as our tender for the solar on top um, one other nice thing is with a bed kit from road Trek, these two beds can turn in or two these four chairs can turn into two single beds so you have the ability to sleep four maybe even five if you get real comfy in the back nice countertop here nice windows we do have the blind down here but 
Uh, very nice to be working, get a lot of natural light in here. Uh, all flush mount utensils so that if you're not using it, you've got more counter space. We do have the sink here, comes up. You've got hot and cold running water again, stainless steel sink. We've got two burner stove. As we look down here, again, more storage, 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 even for those uh, flatter items. Nice little pull out pantry. You got a convection microwave oven, which is nice. More storage down below. And our refrigerator freezer combo. You've got the little freezer section up top. Even has some uh, an ice cube maker in it. There's a manual ice cube maker, uh, but we all know how to do that. Again, storage, European locking system. So now it's locked, it's never gonna open up. They've got nice hinges on them so that when they're up, they're not gonna fall down, hit you in the head. Uh, lighting in this, a little bit different than uh, some of the competitors, but you can manually turn off whichever lights you want. So just a press of a button, kind of a fun game. My nine-year-old, she loves doing that. As we look in here, this is the bathroom area. We've got our toilet as well as our shower, a shower curtain that comes along here and a nice sink there. It does close up nice and tight, but when you're using it, what you want to kind of do is it closes into this uh, fashion. Give you a little bit more elbow room while you're in there doing your business. Again, more storage coming back here. Nice big hanging wardrobe. You can see that we do have the blinds for the front two table legs so you can have a table set up in the back and a table set up in the front at the same time two different card games going on at the same time uh, storage 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 again nice back and all the way in on both ends which is nice so you've got the ability to put a lot of stuff in this little vehicle dvd player a uh, nice flat screen tv that is on an arm and can come around so if you're sitting up front wanting to watch you can do that as well and then this back here is, is your electric sofa. Nice thing about this is you can hang back here, relax. You can have the table set up uh, with the push of a button. It'll start to recline. You hold that button until it gets down to the flat position. Or if you want to keep it kind of as a recliner and use this kind of as a chase lounge, you can stop it at any time, which is really nice. Uh, when it is in a bed configuration, you're meant to sleep this way. Uh, with that being said, there is a board that comes across here. These two cushions come down, makes a full RV queen. So it's very spacious. Like I said, 22 feet, nine inches. This can actually sleep four people. Pretty amazing, pretty impressive. Uh, a lot more things that I've probably failed to tell you about this coach. Uh, give us a call here at Johnson RV, 503-668-5400. And make sure to ask for Brian.